Hello. <laughs> Mostly I'm looking at resources being used and lag and how bad it gets over here. So far it's stayed in the 400 millisecond range. That was before I was streaming. And I'm wondering how this will impact for? it. But I think I found a good VPN for streaming. It does send me all the way to California. <laughs> but <clears throat> so far it's been snappy. I haven't had any issues. I'm just wondering how it will affect the stream. And let me get YouTube chat going. Uh. Sorry, I got my fan on the background. <coughs> A little hot today. Oh, I already got a like. Thank you. Thank you, whoever gave me the like. <laughs> All right, let's pop this chat out. So, 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 so. YouTube chat. Also, there's no way, you're not going to believe this, there's no way to change the language <laughs> on uh, To the Moon. There's no way to do it. Okay, so that that's good. All right, I'm looking at lost frames, and it's saying that I'm upstreaming a solid 7K BPS, which is about the max that I have it set for. Over here, we're still at 344 milliseconds. And everything's quite snappy, at least at least as snappy as it was when I was playing direct from uh, Thailand. So does not seem to be a fundamental difference. I'm going to let this soak while I get some water. <clears throat> and then, uh, then I guess we'll play if it's working. Oh, i got to switch to headphones. I don't know what that'll do. <laughs>
Okay. Frank. What can I help? It continues to be snappy. This is quite playable. So. Let's see if OBN gracefully handles switching to headphones. <sighs> test, test. Eh, not so bad. Not so bad. Okay. Let's go. Move YouTube up here. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> For the horde. All right, I completely sidetracked on everything I was doing. <sighs> Testing the vessel. <clears throat> Back to Feralos, I guess. Metallic. Fragments, Hippogriffs of Feralos. We could do that. That's in Feralos. Beautiful Scepter. Stillward Church. Oh, right. Ravenwood Keep. Ravenwood Keep. Ravenwood Keep. All the raven things are like over here, <coughs> right? Or no? Oh shit! I'm I've out leveled that. Surely I could do that now. This would be the last Gilneas quest, as far as I'm aware. It is an elite, but uh, I think <clears throat> with Combat Rogue, it should be doable. Uh, but we have a lot of inventory we need to deal with here, so let's do that first. Did I check the timer on the Salt Shaker? I didn't. <sighs> Shoot. I think there was still two days on it yesterday, so we're probably not there yet. And finally, a snappy auction house. So. <laughs> Holiday spirits. Well, clearly, that's worth thirty gold. Holiday spices. Turtle meat. Three silver, huh? I'm live. What's up? What do you want? Go think about what you want. <laughs> then come back. Why didn't you go on Friday with me? Because you didn't tell me. I told you two days in advance. forget <laughs> now when 440 you have school tomorrow why don't you order something today Ask your mother to make something.
Go think about what you want. I, I don't want to walk to Sendai today. Huh? Big drive. I don't want to drive either. Yeah. Now you're in trouble. <laughs> oh, I don't want to go out. Well, I'm streaming, so. <laughs> oh my god. Think about something to order. Oh my god. <sighs> Yikes. Too many women in this household. <laughs> All right. Uh, five, ten. Okay, so five silver, roughly. I see. It's kind of all over the place. I think I could get away with five silver each, so I'll try for 50. Hope for the best. <clears throat> Surely someone's going to want to work their food up, and turtle meat's the easiest way to get through the mid-levels. <clears throat> These are even worse. About a silver each. Hmm. A little less than that, actually. All right. I'll price these to sell. I don't know why that cracks me up every time, but it really does. Uh, did all those delicate feathers sell already? They sure did. Those are useful. Um, hmm. Oh, wild mine. Right. Look for a good deal. Oh, <clears throat> my if this then that subscription, pro subscription s ended. So I'm wondering if it deactivated all my stuff. So it might not be telling the server. It is not. Yeah. Uh, I'll have to reactivate that in some fashion. Hmm. What do these do anyways? Oh. Oh, those are nice. No wonder they go for a decent price. Don't these drop in the hinterlands? That's a bid. They're all roughly going for seven each. Yeah. Okay. 
I didn't see any better deals on the higher end either. So. <clears throat> Actually, this is a pretty good deal. And this one too, actually. VPN test seems to be going great. I haven't gotten, I haven't done combat yet, but uh, auction house wise, everything's quite snappy. This is the only really good deal, I guess. Yeah. Math in your head is hard. So these are roughly 10 silverish. So the best ones are the ones closer to seven. Like these. <clears throat> and this one. little bit over but so maybe this one yeah I should really get an auction house <laughs> add-on anyways check it out so three it's been saying this the entire time I even let it sit for a while just to see if it would go up or spike or something, and it has not. And uh, even with the streaming, it's not changing much, so. And the stream seems to be okay. Though, you let me know on your end. You are a hairy wizard, what? get my deep rock salt. Oh, it's right there. Let's go check on the timer on the salt thing. What are you looking for? Three hours. Oh, well, good I checked, I guess. Ah, so good. <clears throat> Alright, let's make some cured thick hides. I'm just going to do all of them this time. I guess we're at the point where we're going to have to start getting Traveler's Backpacks for every slot. Should go check if there's any that are for sale. How much is this one? 16? They're both 16. What cloak am I wearing? Nightscape, 10 agility, 3 stamina. Surely we could do better than that. Let's give it a try. <sighs> no, let me just tell everyone. I am live.
There. What I get? What I get? Defense. What? <laughs> Shit. All right. Did I only have enough for one? Oh my god. Is defense good? That's not even. What the hell does defense do? That's a warrior thing, isn't it? I don't think I even have defense, do I? What's defense? Is that a skill? Oh. Uh. What does defense mean on a rogue? I wasn't part of the balance team, so <laughs> no idea. All right, well. That was kind of disappointing. Anyways, let's just grab all this. Oh, wait. Let's grab these. I think what we'll do is we'll just take this out into the field, and then as we get thick leather, we'll... Oh, that's a quest item. As we get thick leather, we'll um, <clears throat> make stuff. Wait, heavy? Do I have enough to upgrade a thick here? Yeah, yeah, I do. <clears throat> oh, yeah, there we go. Hey, PCA, going well actually. Surprisingly, the VPN is working well for uh, streaming. A lot better than I expected. These look the s they are the same. It's the same art. That's why I was confused. I thought I had a lot more thick leather than I did. Oh, well. Um. Whew. Oh. <coughs> Excuse me. I need a mute button. Yikes. Ah. <coughs> Hopefully I didn't blow any eardrums out. <clears throat> All right. I think we're going to... Do we sell these now? or Because I think I accomplished what I needed to with them. And I have no need for... Oh, jeez. I think I'm allergic to something. <clears throat> I have no more need for... Uh... <laughs> Thank you. No more need for them. Uh, All right. Let's get these out of here. I don't need these. We can sell them on the auction house, I guess. They were pretty cheap, too. We'll try to sell these as well. <clears throat> oh, I forgot to sell that. This, I believe I will be able to use at some point. Uh, these, I want to keep in my inventory to try and make stuff as I get thick leather. I'll probably get more heavy leather along the way. We have the rugged leather. We should probably use up the rugged leather. This we should sell. This is a quest. This we should sell. <clears throat> Can just hold on to this. Quest. Let's move the quests down here. We need more of these. Or at least we need more of these. All right, cool, I guess. I don't know, really. <clears throat> Oof. Anchor of Undeath. Why am I holding on to that? I don't know. Dekine, I got more of those. We'll hold on to these. I don't even know if they're useful. And we're keeping this because of the daggers. Giant egg. That's for a quest, isn't it? Undabu. It's this. It's not. Crocolisk meat, stag meat, cheap beer, cheap beer, tender crab meat, cheap beer. 
Are these in the auction? Let's go. Maybe we can just pick them all up and be done with it. Got to try and sell all this too. <clears throat> no. <laughs> Automated light. Turtle scale. Yeah, these are really cheap, aren't they? Yeah, here we go. 59, uh. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> what? I think I can roughly get away with 152. And yeah, that's fine. If someone wants to bid, I'll take it. <clears throat> 75. <clears throat> Wild leather cloak of agility. Oh, are these the options? <laughs> Not great, actually. <sighs> Plus two agility. I mean, I'd take it, I guess, but. <clears throat> Would a defensive cloak even make sense for anyone? Like maybe a bear druid? Or should I just vendor it? I mean, I really don't know. I'll, I'll try. I'll try it 250 and just maybe. <laughs> so Abjurer's Tunic of Arcane. Wrath. Here's one. Three gold, 54, really? Interesting. Those are level 50, this is level 48. Not great, to be honest. Probably just buy the 51 and then wait. We'll vendor that. <sighs> okay. Hibernal bracers, probably not great. <coughs> I think we put these up before. Yeah, we're gonna vendor that. Enchant weapon, demon sling. Really? Formula? Hyphen. <laughs> Ah, 15 silver. <laughs> and we'll be vendoring that too. Uh, vibrant plume. Eight silver, huh? Vendor. Is that it? I think so. What else do we need to do? Oh, look at Traveler's Backpacks. Hmm. <coughs> That's not bad. Yeah, I'll take that. Will I take more?
bit increment is too small. I see. Twenty-four is not bad either. How many of these do we need? Not too many. <clears throat> I guess the real question is, do I buy the new slot in the bank? <laughs> Finish it up. <laughs> Final slot. There we go. Uh, move all this over here. Why am I carrying these? I don't know. go <clears throat> and these can be resold which we will do okie doke <clears throat> well first we'll just get rid of the uh, well let's see what the auction house has to say about giant eggs I don't know why I was collecting them I I think I thought they were for something. I mean, guess fifty eight, fifty five. Rune cloth bag. How much are these going for these days? <coughs> Two forty-five, two Okay, <clears throat> rest of this gets vendored. Well met. Yeah, yep, totally. Okay. <clears throat> Uh, oh, 
Agtor, Bloodfist, and Ajara. Oh, for fuck's sake. And what's this? Feraloss. Okay. Feraloss, Ajara. These are opposite sides of the world. That's Felwood. There's Ajara. It's close. Uh, in theory. I don't... I don't think I've been there. Okay. How, are we, how do we get there? Warcaller. The Plaguelands. It's yellow? What's yellow? This? It is yellow, but it's not bad. <clears throat> East of Tirisfall Glade and the Under City. Go think about it? No. Oh, I guess I won't think about it. <clears throat> Camp Mujache. Oh, right. What are we going to do? Uh, let's see about getting to Ajara. Since I haven't been there, I'm wondering if there's a... I mean, we should go there and get a flight path, if nothing else. So we could get to Everlook, and then we'd have to travel south, I'm guessing. It's a straight shot to Everlook. I see stuff sold already. Warcraft 3, Lord of the Clans Reforged. Oh my. <laughs> oh boy. Is this a Jara? Could I? I could have gone through Ashenvale. Cause now I'm gonna. Oh, is there no way? Maybe there's a cave system. I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> I remember there being a cave on the other side, but I think it dead ends. But I'm not sure. Temple of Zin Malor. Have I been here? Yeah. Can't seem to remember. Timber Maw. Ursula. I think things aren't spawning in quick enough for me to see what monsters and stuff are out there. Oh well. Still holding steady at 340 it says, but... This is how you get to Everlook? <laughs> what the frick? All right, I have no idea if those that's traversable. Is that a house over there?
just dead ass over water. It's also a reference to the nice pissed wave sound from Warcraft 3. Uh, it's yellow is a reference? What? Maybe that's the way through. We'll find out soon. <laughs> what the heck? Hey, we made it. A book. Ah. Oh, okay. This is quite quite a zone for me. We're in danger. Yeah, but the line from Monty Python is um. What is your favorite color? Blue. No, green. Ah! <laughs> what do you want? At least I think that's what it is. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've seen that uh, movie, I guess. Turtle meat went fast. See, someone was cooking. Outbid. Oh, well. Someone's probably got a bot washing stuff. Argent Dawn, huh? At the Bulwark, Western Platelands. For the Alliance. Ah, uh, yeah. <clears throat> Plague lands. Where? Uh, we're not here for this. Uh, Darrowshire. <clears throat> hey, Shakasan. Search for my family. Is this the depressing one where everyone's dead? I got the best deals anywhere. Well... I got what you need. Okay. Hmm, interesting. Yeah, what do you want? Hey, how you What's doing? Up? Hey, uh... Got the best deals anywhere. I have a deal for mm. you. Yeah, what do you want? You come mm -hmm. get the voodoo. Good day to you. Yo! What's up? Time is money, friend. Hmm. Yo. All those books. And dynamite. <laughs> Nothing readable. Yo. No. There he is, the man himself. Talk to me. Time is money, friend. Time is money, friend. <laughs> oh, I could make 
these. Or one of them. Nah, I guess we will. No reason not to. <clears throat> We're just going to sell them to the vendor anyways. <clears throat> I guess I sh should wait on that, actually. Shoot. Probably mm, should have bought that. Time is money, friend. Yo! Yeah, we're gonna just, we'll just store all this right here. I think it's a little silly to carry everything around. We're, we'll, we'll get to this. Heavy, rugged, thick. And that's not related at all. <clears throat> all right. Be good. Fellow connoisseur of wow, tasteful storytelling. Hello there. <laughs> Whoa, you got angry. What's up? Can I show you my wares? Aha! Potential customers. Yeah, what do you want? Time is money, friend. All right. The Thorium Brotherhood. Hey, how you doing? In Felwood. Not fair loss. I think because all these quests right here are within easy reach of um, Ogremar, I don't really see the need to grab them right now. And instead, I'll just focus on getting through this territory and uh, to Ajara. Jesus. Okay. I need to be careful out here, I guess. <laughs> So it's this way. See if we can pick up any map points without dying on the way. There's stealth stuff, so I do need to be careful. Mm. No, because that would go to the ocean. That wouldn't make any sense at all. <clears throat> Chillwind Chimera. Ah, neutral. That's good. Don't want to get stuck down there. Mazlaril. Another cave. These would go to Hyjal, in theory. If they went anywhere at all. Where, oh, where am I going? <clears throat> I remember there being giants towards the south. I guess we'll see. Stay away from there. Huh. These are all neutral. Discovered Dunmadar. 
those are not neutral. They've got a little cave, doesn't probably doesn't go anywhere, so no point in in investigating that, I guess. <coughs> ah. I remembered correctly. <laughs> Frostmall giant. Did he kite that from down there? No, they're everywhere. Okay. <coughs> Here's the ice bridge I saw. Are these hostile? Wait, let's check. Oh, they are. Okay. So I have a lot to be concerned about. Because the odds are they could probably one-shot me if they got their hands on me. Will this even get me to Ajara? I know the aggro range is quite high when you're lower level, so... My goal here is just to get to a high point and see if I can... Jesus H. <laughs> See if I can um, spot something. Huh? Ah, just exploring. Small thorium vein. I wonder. Oof, that's steep. Let's go this way. <clears throat> Looks almost climbable. But maybe not. Let's go this way. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I don't want to die. <laughs> It'd be annoying. I think if it turns fruitless, I'll just port over to um, I'll just hearth. Yeah, and this is not looking great for getting around anything. I do want to try. I do want to try this, but okay, there's nothing below. Oh, it looks like I almost could. Ah, you sons of bitches! Let me up. I I see an angle. You sons of bitches. No? This way then? Nope. Nope. It looks just almost possible. Do you think... I've never really understood <clears throat> if there's like some trick to catching those ledges. Those, those, like, there's an... Or is that perfectly flat? I feel like I could squivel up that who suggested the retrieve body mechanic for arrival and wow um i th think it was uh you know i'm not 100 percent sure because i'm not in those meetings but i think it came from rob pardo or he stole it from someone <laughs> 
because he stole ideas from people all the time. <clears throat> but, and then presented it as his. Uh, but, yeah, it was definitely, it came from not wanting things to be as punishing as EverQuest, where you just, like, lose levels and the will to live. And, um, oh, this person's running through. I just aggroed a bear. This guy's running through. Maybe I can escape. Where's he going? Oh, he's going to that cave. Is that a way through? No, he's not going to that cave. Where are you going? This this person knows something. I'm following them. What do they know? Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> don't find me. What do they know that I don't? Where are you going? Show me the way. I think they're about to get absolutely wrecked. <laughs> okay. They went that way. Does this lead to Azara? Oh, man. <gasps> no! I almost got one shot right there. Oh boy. Where am I? Dark Whisper Gorge. Oh, jeez. Looks like there's enough space between things that I could almost escape, but. Escape to where? That looks like it would go to Hyjal. Not to Ajara. So maybe if I hug this wall. Never touch the blood unless you have a party around you. What? Oh, blood pool. Shouldn't it be more drastic to revive more penalties? No, because you get demoralized and then you quit. <clears throat> Look, the penalty for losing what you were doing and um, <laughs> just all the time it takes to get back to your corpse is so much of a penalty, especially the older you get. You just don't have time for de-leveling. <clears throat> go play EverQuest <clears throat> and go cycle die on a raid. <laughs> and when you lose your max level, <laughs> you let me know how that feels. <laughs> Does that feel good to you? No. It was just too punishing, so we scaled it back, and rightfully so. It's just the the loss of time is more than enough. You've got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. All right. <clears throat> is my vanish back up? It's not. All right. I'm just worried something's going to walk towards me and wreck me. Getting a massage in like 20 minutes. <laughs> I'm just wondering. No worries. <clears throat> no, jeez. Oh, no. What were they doing? Fuck. No, no, no. No, no, I'm dead. <clears throat> Fuck. Where's the graveyard? A million miles away. <laughs> Motherfuckers. See, look at this penalty. And then there's the durability on your gear goes down. Do you really need to de-level de as well? Like, I don't know. It leads to Hyjal. You can get to Ajara from Ashenvale. Fuck. Fail. 
Where? Oh. Really? Son of a bitch. <clears throat> Here, time this. It's 5.35 p.m. Probably going the wrong way. There could have been slightly less gruesome consequences. Luckily, Turtle Wow added a 5% XP loss on death with no deleveling. What? There's a XP loss? Don't do that shit. Take it away. Take it away. Remove that immediately. Jesus Christ. Like, no one wants to die. That's the only thing <laughs> that you need uh, in terms of, like, if no one wants to die, if there's no good reason to die... If there's no cheese that involves dying repeatedly, then what is it? Who cares? <laughs> it doesn't need to be so fucking punishing that you want to end yourself <laughs> when you die. <clears throat> it's like, relax, people. <laughs> no! We need whips and chains. And you have to install a special kit that puts barbed wire around your neck. And whenever you die, it, it chokes you. It's like, Jesus, calm down. Every time you die, it cuts off one of your fingers. <laughs> Games of the future. Force reactive disc. What is that? <clears throat> oh, it's a shield. Take away all XP, all items, and temp ban for one day after death could be reasonable. That's reasonable to you? <laughs> Who would play that game? I tell you what, after WoW came out, no, everyone moved away from punishing deaths. The last one I played that had a punishing death, uh, in fact, it was part of the inspiration for why EverQuest was too harsh. And there was a hardcore contingent of like EverQuest aficionados who were like, No, when you die... You should lose all your XP, blah, blah, blah. And you should de-level. Oh, it's part of the fun of EverQuest, blah. And it's like, it's not fun. That wasn't fun. It's only fun for hardcore people who can completely avoid it. Which isn't fun. It's just avoidance of the anti-fun. Right? Like, you have to understand the difference between uh, a game play mechanic that is enjoyable or makes things more enjoyable and a gameplay mechanic where it's so punishing that for the people who can't avoid it it it's just oh, we're gonna get aggro instantly fucking hell it didn't work let's okay maybe we can res on the other side of this and maybe that will let me get oh. Oh, I died just right in the middle of shit I'm going to explore actually look another cave 
No, that goes to Hyjal. Does it go to Hyjal? No, well, there's nothing stopping me from exploring while dead. <laughs> I just don't know if there's enemies in here. It looks like it does not go to Hyjal. Oh, I'm far, far away from that. All right, F'd. Totally F'd in the A. <clears throat> uh, huh? I'm live. I'll send Rhea. No, she'll die. And you'll go to jail for criminal negligence. I'll send Rhea. I'll send Rhea. Uh, good thing you can never pick up the challenge and it's completely optional here. Optional here. Huh? What are you talking about? <clears throat> Let's see. Can I get my corpse? There's nothing on the left here. Where the hell is my body? There it is. That's aggro, for sure. Okay, we're gonna have to go this way. And that patrol and go okay great uh, we're hearthing out of here I don't want to deal with this shit anymore this looks like a safe space oh there you are <laughs> and I'm out <laughs> <clears throat> Back to the safety and comfort of the land I know. <laughs> All right. So I can get to Ajara from Ashenvale. Let's try that, I suppose. Sure. You didn't check on that custom orc trader at the den, the starting location? Uh, what? Custom orc trader? <laughs> Thanks, Shokasan. Uh, I don't know. Don't know about any custom orc trader. At the pool. Yeah, take go to the pool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take it to the pool. Go. I want to go to the pool. Just take it to the pool. Just do it. I'll order whatever you want. baby's at the pool and she wants water <laughs> so. we uh, we must all cater to her demands Ashenvale, Ajara, Ashenvale, Ajara, Ashenvale. I see, I see, I see, I see. 
And we're getting dumped here? Here. So we'll just head up the northern road. I feel like I've been there, but I clearly haven't. It's strange. <coughs> My giant egg sold. How exciting. <laughs> I wouldn't call in praise. Shokasan, are you Thai? <laughs> Warsong Gulch, sixty sixty. What's that? <clears throat> One demand per week BIS policy for kids wants to meet the needs. <laughs> I just don't want her drinking pool water, which she's she knows not to, but I do, in the back of my mind, I go, she might get thirsty enough that she's just like, well, I'm surrounded by water. I may as well drink it. <clears throat> the real question is, <laughs> why her mother doesn't bring a glass of water <laughs> with her uh, when she goes to the pool, knowing that this happens almost every single time. <laughs> so, that's kind of my question. But, uh, you know, not allowed to question the wife <laughs> when it comes to that sort of stuff. It'll just be excuses, too. Ah, I'm busy, and I'm carrying this other stuff that she needs, and blah, blah, blah. It's like, okay. <laughs> Why don't you get a bag? <laughs> a bag that can hold a cup of water. We have multiple cups of water that are, like, uh, what do you call it? Not sealable, but, like, they have a top on them. But anyways, whatever. Did you do it? You gave her water? Oh. And now you're dead? Was it that difficult? Oh, come on. What did you want to eat? Here, look, I found this place. Calm down. This place, it looks like they have crispy pork and stuff. Anyways, it looks decent. It's like Thai food. Check it out. <clears throat> Are they good? I don't know. We ha I haven't tried them yet, but it looks good. Ah, Rip from Age Phrase. What a name. They have chicken. They have what? They have egg fried chicken. Okay. Fries. Yeah, they have a lot of stuff. Yeah. Pick something that looks good. <laughs> no? They, uh... <laughs> you should. It's the only. Th it's only that many things wives can remember. <laughs> hmm. Gonna get me in trouble here. Come on. <laughs> okay. Nothing's appearing on the map. What is this? Have I really never been here? I feel like I have. This looks like the. If you die, this is where you go. All right. Level 46. That's not bad. Maybe that's why they sent me here. What are these? Thunderhead. Stage one. Huh? Oh my god. Why? You want to eat sushi? What's wrong with that sushi? What's wrong with sushi from the app? <laughs> I, 
I need stag meat. Huh? Why you want to drive? Sun grass. It says it's a oh. Where does this go? Am I gonna get attacked? I feel like this involves some sort of quest. Huh? Oh, I would have to bring everyone. Okay, ask your mother then. No. <laughs> this is, you want this, not me. I'm playing WoW and I'm happy. <laughs> I, I said I'd order you whatever you want. Now you don't anything in the world that seems to be not good enough for you, so... <laughs> uh-huh. Make sushi at home? It would be a whole set of ingredients. And we had Japanese rice for like three years. And we let bugs eat it. That's how much we use it. I can make crispy fried pork. I need pork. <laughs> Oh my god. This <clears throat> bug. Ask your mother. Surely there's a place that has crispy fried pork.
Would you recommend classic Cataclysm to a new WoW player? No. I would recommend Turtle WoW <laughs> to a new player. Especially to a new player. Even, like... They just sort of lost the whole point of what WoW was supposed to be. Because they always want to iterate on their product to maximize income. <clears throat> so ultimately, what you end up with is something that nobody understands anymore. <laughs> uh, women's brains start to rewire its functioning towards the limbic system to catering children better? I didn't know that. That sounds... Nonsensical, actually, but <laughs> I am not a neurologist, so what do I know? Could you at least close my door fully so the aircon doesn't leak out? No. No? The biggest issue with Cataclysm, just that it's, if you didn't know what was there before, you have no point of reference for what's there now. Like, Cataclysm really only makes sense to people who have played Classic. <laughs> so. biggest issue with Cataclysm. They deleted my quests. <laughs> Several of them. I mean, the biggest issue with Cataclysm is simply it's a different world. It's not, it's not classic. It's not what people remembered. If you play for nostalgia, you go to cla uh, Cataclysm, it's not the same game. All there is to it. What? Why? That's ridiculous. Ask your mother. Give me my phone back. Our new cataclysm zones good? Eh. What, why are you, why are you whining? Then talk to your mother. No. No, the onus is on you because you want to go. I don't. I've already been twice this week. I don't want to go again. It's not my fault. My friends all wanted to go there. Your fault for not going when you had the chance. On Friday, you could have ordered whatever you wanted. He was paying. Go away. Oh my god. <sighs> Teenage daughters. You're not gonna lack you're gonna you're not gonna die from lack of one particular restaurant. You're not. I'm pretty sure there's nothing they have there that you need. <laughs> <laughs> I do not have it's just yeah it's just a completely different game it's like um 
Cataclysm is a more analytical approach to- Shut up! Go away! What the fuck? What do you want? Then go, ask your mother. Ew. No! Ew. Ow! Never. Shoo! Oh my god. <laughs> Never have teenage daughters. <laughs> they are a nightmare every time. Anyways, Cataclysm should have been WoW 2, yes. It was a completely different game. A more analytical approach to how to create zones and enemies and blah, 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 blah. What the hell are you doing? Oh my god. Go talk to your mother. Go talk to your mother. You can't? No. You're physically incapable. Cancel the teenage daughter subscription? Yeah, I'm blocking your Roblox. No. <laughs> Get out of here. Yeah. When your mother gets back, you can ask her. Uh, 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 end of the world. So dramatic. So freaking dramatic. Ah. <laughs> 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 <sighs> uh. Make her go read the Lord of the Rings books. Oh my god, I've been trying to get her to read forever. Ever since she was a little kid. The only thing that uh, she seemed to enjoy was when I would read manga to her. So I read her One Piece. <clears throat> but like, real books? Ugh. Impossible. Impossible. Oops, wrong one. Damn. Thanks for making my childhood better by making Warcraft 3. Um, well, I can't really take all the credit for that, but uh, for my small parts, you're most welcome, and I'm glad you enjoyed it. He is aggro. Definitely do not want to accidentally run into that. This is inspired, actually, by the hill giant in EverQuest uh, in the um, desert beach zone area. I forgot the name of it. But there was there's like a hill giant that would run around in that zone. But half the fun of that hill giant was that you could um, aggro it and then run it onto other people. And then there were a couple classes that could lose aggro by various means. And then it would, like just kill everyone <laughs> and people would do it all day every day on purpose kiting that thing on to people and getting them killed and then the every once in a while a mod would uh come through and ban them <laughs> <clears throat> feel free to jump back to turtle while once you're done with the horrors of cataclysm <laughs> yeah Actually, you know what? Friends don't let friends play Cataclysm. <laughs> Just don't do it. It's soulless. You know, I'm, I'm sorry to say, but it's it's soulless. The the thing that makes 
World of Warcraft, such a classic game that is forever sealed in everyone's mind as the the MMORPG, is that boot boutique 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 nature of like all the hand designed areas and quests and everything like that. Cataclysm kind of harms it because it. I'm not saying it's bad, and they still did most things by hand, but. There was definitely a more analytical approach to how questing and things were placed. It's just feels a little bit more robotic and less alive. <sighs> but that's just my opinion. Mm -mm, can't see. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, it's vanilla plus. So it's got, it's like basically one to one with the one of the original versions that were released to the game very early on, plus additional content such as the high elf uh, race and the goblin race. But it's built in a way that it's very similar to not just the spirit, but the original intent of that World of Warcraft classic as opposed to approaching it in a more cynical way <laughs> where you're just getting things done. Which... I mean, after they fired basically every quest content designer, uh, it was after the... the first expansion, I guess. Uh, actually, I'd have to look it up. I don't remember exactly. I have a... There's an interview with Christine Brownell, who was one of the uh, quest designers who went through launch of WoW, and uh, you should watch that interview with her. Because there was, uh, they fired almost all the quest designers uh, for WoW just before a bonus check came out. You know, and so like, you know, th there's people who are like, oh, Blizzard used to be great and everything. I don't know about that. <laughs> they did some pretty cynical shit back in the day. And uh, from when I originally worked there to this day, they are still one of the lowest paying uh, development studios in, uh, in America compared to other studios. So... There's 4,000 people playing right now, I think. 3,996. Close, so close. But yeah, it's around 4K average. When I first started, if you look at my like one of my first videos, I think we broke 1,000 and we were like, oh, wow. <laughs> and now it's like well over that all the time. Also, I must say this VPN is doing a great job. Yeah, that was long before the Activision takeover. Like, everyone's like, oh, Activision ruined it. Nah, there was some rot. <laughs> there was something rotten in the state of Denmark <laughs> long before anyone else took over. Some of it was negligence. Some of it was incompetence. A lot of it was growing too fast after WoW and not understanding the consequences of that and not reinstating the real company culture because um, the real company culture of Blizzard as, it, as I understood it when I joined and as it was for uh, all of Warcraft 3's development for the most part was that like it's a game studio full of people who love making games and who love playing games like that's it that was like all the other principles and stuff you could sort of set aside but it was like a game studio of gamers who love games. 
And it reflected in all the work that we did. <clears throat> like, we actually care. And that was the difference, predominantly, between us and other studios. Oh, he died before the shot went off. That's annoying. <clears throat> um, but after WoW shipped, something changed. Something changed. Like, I mean, it was already sort of going in that direction because of certain individuals there who were more about themselves than they were about games. But... Firing started right after Warcraft 3 released. There was some firing there. I was one of the people. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, there were several rounds of layoffs. But there was a big round of layoffs... Uh, just before the bonus checks for World of Warcraft after the initial launch. Like a big round of layoffs. It made the news. And um, I have a little bit of an inside scoop. I'm not going to name anyone, but uh, it, was, it was a cash grab initiated by a certain individual. Because after all, if you get rid of like a bunch of staff, then there's a lot more in the bonus pool to go go to the uh, higher level executives. It's just sad. <clears throat> yeah, nothing's more poignant than seeing the cars that would drive into the lot uh, within a week of a uh, bonus check going out, depending upon who <laughs> the individuals were. And then meanwhile, me, it's like, oh... This bonus check makes up for the salary, almost, makes up for the salary that I would have gotten at any other studio, except that it is taxed at a much higher rate because it's a bonus. <laughs> so, so, what the fuck? Like, how can it, uh, how can they be so greedy? <clears throat> that was always what I wondered. Like, any project that I work on, I want to share equally with everyone who's involved. And um, when I'm doing projects, uh, for fun, generally, I ask to be paid commiserate with what other people are making. And um, I'll often take lower pay initially for a larger bonus pool later. Which some people would say I'm dumb for. <laughs> Make sure this isn't important. I didn't want to leave till I get that last stag meat. I just realized I want that. Uh, I have nine. I need one more. So I don't know if there's more stag ahead of me. So better to get it here. <clears throat> Does Zenrise still gain skills from firing the gun? Yeah. Yep. It's such a spit in the face, just disgusting. Look at my new car, you peons. I mean, I'm sure they didn't understand how that looked. Because, you know, they'd been there a long time, so they're like, oh, I deserve this. Right? Guns just went up to 218. If you were curious. All right, I got the last stack. Uh, how much thick leather did I get off of this? Nice. Let's move this over here. <laughs> Her mother's not having it. You know what? They're right here. I'm just going to... I don't know. More leather, right? What could go wrong? Extra stag meat in case something happens. <clears throat> I cannot do that yet. 
I played classic and it was only fun with a friend for you personally. Waiting for mobs to spawn and spending 30 minutes on one quest wasn't that fun, but I love the music in Night Elf area. You know, it doesn't happen that often on the server. Um, yeah, I don't... I think there's only been like two... You can watch the entire journey <laughs> through Turtle Well if you want. But I think that's only happened like once or twice where I was waiting on mobs. Um, but there is an element of like fun to that too not gonna lie like i definitely get frustrated in the moment but then it forces me to think about what else i could do and um i don't know i guess that's part of wow time management Delivering bad news to the daughter. Where am I going? I actually don't have any idea. Uh, we'll just... We'll go one way and then the other, I suppose. I do need to be careful here, though. I suspect I could get wrecked pretty hard if I'm not careful. Is this distant enough? It's not. That looks like a quest. Definitely a quest for these blue crystals. I don't think that's going to help. Level 51. Temple of Zin Malor. Mm, this is cleared so we can explore a little bit this way. Level 50s. <coughs> Shattered Strand. Huh. Looks like there's a bunch of people leveling out here. Earth Grip. <laughs> what a name. Dave, don't you feel like Garot should grant at least two CP by default? Uh, isn't that, isn't there like a talent for that? I think there is. By default too? Why would it grant two by default? It's quite powerful on its own. Like damage wise, it's one of the highest ones. <clears throat> Oh. oh, 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 oh. We have a reason to be here now. Very, very important one. <laughs> he just walked right st Bastard. Stop! How does that happen? are runners, right? No, he's not running. Looked like he was going to run at the last second there. <clears throat> no, I don't have a problem with Garot only having one point. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, he's serious. Oh, he's quite serious. 
Uh, this is probably for a quest. Alright, I used up my cooldowns on that. I think it's fine. I think I'm worth it to get this. <laughs> for me, anyways. <clears throat> There's got to be quests for this area. Firefin. Yeah. Tempted to just fish, but it's so dangerous with all these guys here. There's easier Firefin to get. Is that the only lockbox? There's got to be more. Oh, floating wreckage. That might be worth the risk. <clears throat> uh, have you seen the Warcraft 2 campaign in Warcraft 3 Reforged that was made by... Yeah, I saw it. Chronicles of the Second War, yeah. I haven't played it yet. It's on my list. I'm supposed to play that and re reforged a uh, human campaign. Mithril. Mm. We're going to run out of room real fast. <laughs> That's probably close enough. <clears throat> a fan-made Warcraft 3 campaign telling the Warcraft 2 story. Yeah, it's, it's Chronicles of the Second War. I'm, I'm very familiar with it, and I know the people who are working on it. and I think they've done an excellent job. They showed me an early cinematic like a, couple, like a year ago. And I gave some feedback on it. Oh, I have a different sword now. And we are out of poison. And we are running out of poison. Yeah, they did a good job. No, no complaints <laughs> should be made. <laughs> Surely there, there can be criticism. But, uh, I don't know. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. I'm looking for boxes here. <clears throat> they only spawn in like that one location look it's back hmm oh it's in the water all right we should definitely kill this guy if we're gonna go for that one Really? Damn it. So they must be in the ocean a little bit. At least this one is. Let's take a look out here, actually. OK. 
Okay, that camera bug, even in the ocean, is super annoying. No. Okay, this guy's respawned. Higher level this time. <laughs> I have all my cooldowns, so it shouldn't be an issue. This is respawned as a different creature. Also higher level. I don't know what kind of caster it is. Scroll of strength, you say. Black Pearl? Isn't that super valuable? Have I tried lowering the DPI on my mouse to fix the camera bug? Why would that, dude? Why would... Huh? Shit. Why would lowering the DPI in my mouse do anything? I'm not I'm not clear on how that would change things. I'm gonna fish this out because I think there's a chance it respawns as a uh loot. <laughs> <clears throat> Polling rate? How would you even change that? <laughs> What's in the polling rate? It's a wired mouse. Are you talking about something that involves wireless mice? I cannot carry anymore. Shit. Uh, get out of here. camera is broken if your polling rate is over 125 why would you want a, a lower wait okay so what is the polling rate on a mouse it's a uh, logitech g502 hero it's back okay definitely want to do that there's also a spawn over here, though, that I need to watch out for. Just want to get this gone first. <clears throat> Mouses have tails, so wireless mice should be called hamsters. 100% agree. Comment of the year. <laughs> Wireless mice should be called hamsters, and I will forevermore call wireless mice hamsters. <laughs> and then you can ask, do you have a hamster or a mouse? <laughs> that is definitely genius. Yeah, I like that. <clears throat> All right. What was this, cheese? Fine aged cheddar. Get the fuck out of here. And this one's up too. All right, we've got a little cycle going. Oh, I failed? Wow. All right then. Moonberry juice can go F itself. This not respond yet. This guy will respond next and then the raider. Since we have free time <laughs> let's go kill something else i guess how many times per second the info sensor is red 
Okay. I don't have flint and tinder. Oh, for fuck's sake. <clears throat> Do I still have that? I don't have that. Oh, that one spawned. Superior. Hello, Major. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, check for the box. No box there. The box that should be here is over here. And it's not. No spawn for fishing. Okay. Maybe it's slowed down. Is it a five minute timer? Nope, there it is. My perception of time has been destroyed. Honestly, probably shouldn't be killing this guy over and over again because... Oh, okay. He spawns a little bit faster than the other one? I definitely killed him separately. Um, Shizer. Uh, is this here? It didn't respawn. Okay, what's going on? These are not... This one did. Maybe that other one spawned at another location. Sometimes they have shared uh, spawns. And if they have shared spawns, it spawns in the, a different location from that one. And until that one is cleared, I won't get this one. So, nope, it's here. Overthinking. <clears throat> Maybe they don't have shared spawns in Classic. I actually don't know. Thoughts on Diablo 4? Uh, a harmful cash grab. <laughs> it's similar to Diablo Immortal. And I had, I actually had called it that if Diab because of Diablo Immortal's success, that they were going to sneak in monetization aspects of that into Diablo 4, and they sure as fuck did. So, shit. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but it worked for me. So I don't know about this polling rate. I don't know how to change the polling rate on my mouse. Like, I don't... No. What the fuck is a dingle hopper? What the fuck is a dingle hopper? Please just be cash. Oh, thick leather. Okay, we can keep the dingle hopper for now. Although it's not ideal. <laughs> uh, fishing locations are not respawning. I wonder if they've shifted down shore. I've lost track of the order now. <laughs> Something about the boss spawn, or whatever he is, weirded me out. Um, <clears throat> okay, I need water. Oh! I had the camera client fix mod, but I think I removed it because it didn't do anything. So I was worried it might mess something else up, or if I did find a fix, it would screw that up. So I tend to, um, <clears throat> if there are like patches or fixes or things and they don't work, I just get rid of them immediately so that I don't have a bunch of extra, cra <laughs> extra crap uh, sitting on my system. <clears throat> 
this, this, these two will spawn together now. Or will, it seems like he'll, he'll definitely spawn. Counterfeit shell coin? <laughs> uh, this should have, oh, there it is. But where's the, oh, I already killed that one. Okay, so everything's on different timers and I'm not familiar with them for some reason. Usually they're on the same cycles. I can't believe I'm failing these, but good, I guess. <clears throat> Let's see if this one's just, eh, son of a bitch. Whatever. Oh, it's up, it's up, it's up, it's up. Oh boy. Shit. Let's get it away from I cannot hit this guy. Hmm. Rough. That was really rough. An even bigger problem than the monetization Diablo 4 is lack of epicness. You're in hell for five minutes, then it's closed forever. It felt so bad. Ugh. I haven't even played, and honestly, I don't. I don't want to. <laughs> it's just not the same game. Because these are different people, right? It's not... Um... I'm going to have to delete shit here. Do that one. It's not the same people who did Diablo. You know what I mean? It's a different team. Blizzard North was a different team than Blizzard. They're not the same. And um, it's, a, it's a real struggle to come to uh, explain that to people. Like, like, isn't Blizzard just Blizzard? It's like, no, not really. Blizzard was two different companies. And one of them was Blizzard North, and Blizzard North was a, originally Condor Studios. And they had a different mentality for what they were making, and different ideas, and definitely a darker, grittier feel. And, um, yeah, none of that when they basically fired everyone, <laughs> which is pretty much what happened. They, they, um, Blizzard North tried to negotiate with Vivendi to get more negotiation power at the at the table. They wanted like more say in their destiny. And Vivendi and they threatened to all uh they threatened with their resignations. And Vivendi accepted their resignations. <laughs> <coughs> As a result of that. So that's Blizzard North the, the those were all the executives of blizzard north <clears throat> executives president and all that so they were all gone and so what's left you know um and then uh blizzard south in pretty cr cruelly if you ask me <clears throat> told them uh if you move to southern california they were in northern california if you move to southern california and you you might get your job <clears throat> you might get to keep your job or can work here maybe maybe and uh moving your whole family from northern california to southern california on the possibility of a job is that's fucked and uh crap Sh shouldn't have gone down that way 
So, and after that, ever forevermore, it was never really Diablo anymore. Let's let's be real. Diablo three did not feel like a Diablo game to me. I don't know about you. Diablo four, Diablo Immortal felt like a heartless cash grab. The gameplay was enjoyable enough, but it didn't feel like a Diablo game to me. It felt like a something else reskinned as a Diablo game. <laughs> and I'm told that maybe it was. And um, I just had no interest in even trying Diablo 4. Unfortunately, they've got a lock on... Well, I mean, you know, there's Path, Path of Exile, so I would go play that. That's a more close spiritual successor to Diablo 2 than anything else that I've seen. <clears throat> In fact, the game I'm working on, Engines of Fury, is actually got a got some Diablo 2 esque elements to it that we're working on. I feel like I just killed that guy. How long am I gonna stay here? Let's think about this for a second. I was supposed to, what am I even doing here? I bet you there's all sorts of quests I'm missing out on. I should get this to 250 if I can. <clears throat> oh, he's up. I don't want to lose this timetable. Fuck. Bullshit. Maybe this one got pulled by someone else and I didn't see it. It's possible. I was underwater for a bit. <clears throat> Are my messages getting auto-deleted? I'm trying to say to get the official Logitech configuration app to change your polling rate. I guess they were, yeah. I didn't see them. Sorry. <clears throat> I have the official Logitech app. I'll look at it, I guess. I I'm probably safe right now. Logitech G-Hub. New version available. Install later, install now. Oh, fine. Is that going to disconnect my mouse? <laughs> <clears throat> it's installing. It's just killing everything. Removing current version. Okay, great. Oh. Hold on. It's loading. New devices supported. New games supported. Got it. G502 Hero. Report rate per second. Choose how often the mouse reports information. 1,500, 250, 125. All right. Just for wow, I'll drop it to, you said 150? I'll drop it to 125. And then we'll see if I get that bug again. Hmm. I've, I've just been demanded to order food. Let's see if I can do it without dying. Oh, we're there. Ah, shit. <laughs> The problem is there's no consistent way to make the bug happen, so we just have to sort of let go. Wait, it hasn't happened in a while. Maybe it worked. <laughs> you know. I hate that. <laughs> Where's that shitty moonberry juice? Get the F out of my inventory. Yoo-hoo! Oh, that guy's there. We'll have to kill him, yeah. Oh, 
mouth clam. Give me black pearl. Damn it. Pants. Go away, black truffle. Give me the meat. Do I have ten already? Or was I destroying them? I guess I was destroying them. That's not there. And that's not there. All right. We have some time to order food. All right. Great. <clears throat> yep. I'm on 125. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Uh, you can easily incur the bug moving the camera 180 degrees and from top to bottom with your right mouse button pressed down. Okay. Obviously don't want to do that in combat. <laughs> Top left to bottom right would do it. Well, we need to see it happen so that we can. All right, let me just check on the other lockbox and then I'll do it. <clears throat> Huzzah! worthless <clears throat> watch it's like 10 gold uh, okay so in theory we will now set our report rate to a thousand top left to bottom right did not happen oh wait was that it Usually it's when I've been standing still for a bit and then I go, oops, and that's off screen. Well, hold on, I'm, I'm at a thousand now. I can't tell if that's the bug or not. Is that the bug where it like zooms in like that? 
that is the bug. So now we will try without it. So we'll reduce polling to 125. <coughs> nope. Same behavior there. It doesn't look like it fixed it to me, if that was it. Though I'm very unclear on exactly what it is <laughs> that's happening. It's like the camera disconnects and like goes into the world. <coughs> Is that it happening? Oh, shit. Smart pivot option in interface options under camera options. Smart pivot Oh, it, the weirdness where it like kind of goes into the world. I see. And where is that? Smart pivot? Can't look at a menu. <laughs> Hold on. <clears throat> smart pivot. Smart pivot. Smart pivot. Smart pivot. Advanced. Auto clear AFK. Sticky targeting. <clears throat> Smart pivot. Let's you free look when the camera is on the ground. What does that mean? Out of poison. Uh, hmm. I need to get closer. How would I understand what Smart Pivot does <laughs> better <laughs> so that I can determine whether or not I like it? <laughs> a little bit close there. <clears throat> Goodbye, aged cheddar. Thirty three frost spell damage. Is that good for a frost mage? <laughs> Smart pivot snags your camera on the train, and the pivot point is not your character when it's enabled. Huh. Nobody likes Smart Pivot since it's dumb. Why is it defaulted on then? Uh, I'm noticing, I'm feeling like, let me put it that way, I feel like it is less stupid now. So maybe it's been smart pivot the entire time. That would be frustrating. <laughs> 
That would be frustrating. Wow. Cured ham steak. Ah, oh, shit, shit, shit. We want to get on that if we can. This is not there. We're going to have to delete more junk. I think it'll be... <clears throat> this. And this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh. Why did I have a Senegal pet on my queue? <laughs> I don't remember doing that. <laughs> why does why is smart pivot not defaulted to, to off then? It's kind of weird. Didn't I get rum before? Maybe I wasn't able to pick it up. Yeah, that's probably what happened. Oh, I forgot about that shit to make a bracer. Maybe I should just make that bracer now. If I can. Oh, boy. Shit. No, oh, just two. Thick and rugged. How much rugged do I have? Seven? Is that enough? It's probably not. One more. If we get lucky. I have weapons, right? What the shit? <laughs> I do not Blizz wanted players to be spoon fed and grow dependent on the smoothness of the client. <laughs> kind of failed at that. Uh huh. That sounds insane to me. <laughs> Doesn't sound like Blizzard at all. That's just this next guy, all right? <clears throat> Underwater parrot. You update downgraded the graphics so much. Oh, did you like it? You preferred it yesterday with the the cyberpunk expansion. <laughs> cyberpunk wow expansion. I don't know what I'm gonna do with that one. Should I cut that one from the from the list and like reorder them I don't know I mean it's part of the experience of playing turtle I suppose <clears throat> this firefin never respawned which is interesting
<laughs> I stole her hair for a second there. That was weird. <laughs> this one next, yeah? How much more skill do I got to go? No, I killed him before I... Yeah, okay. Or did I? No, I didn't. 48, 49. Okay, two more loops, and then we're done. And then I'll get a quest to come kill this guy. <laughs> That's probably what's going to happen. Let's sigh. <laughs> I should get daggers up. Uh, next time I go go to town, I'll get some daggers up and unarmed fist. The intentions might have been slightly more noble in formulation, but al alas, the results. <laughs> Trash, yeah. The best intentions, the, the road to hell is paved with good intentions. Uh, shoot. What are we tossing here? I guess it's you. Not there. The reason I'm clearing it out is to make sure that it, it spawns. Aha! Uh -huh. It spawns again. <clears throat> because you don't get skill ups anymore if it's not a new one. As we discovered many moons ago. <laughs> Looking for what else I can toss. Probably this. Yeah, it's, I, I do want to go back to Cyberpunk at some point and uh, play with their new systems and like really understand all the changes they've made. Because if you look at the um, game design analysis for Cyberpunk that I did before, I had a lot of pretty harsh criticisms of... Uh, and this is a year after release that I played. I have a bunch of really harsh criticisms of their skill system and their... Um, what you call it, your make stuff system. <laughs> Move this here and get rid of this. Okay. Interesting. And it looks like they addressed most of my criticisms. <laughs> some of them so far we'll see I haven't really I'm like level 2 so who knows So glad I randomly stopped over here because that lock picking thing was bothering me. I hate not having max lock picking, and now I know where to get it. It's still orange. Now I know where to get it, probably to max out. So we're at 250. We're done, actually. Or is it 255? Hold on, let me just make sure here. No, 250, we're done. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, 
don't know where to go though. This way? I'm gonna follow him. He seems to know where he's going. <clears throat> it's also significantly faster than me. Damn it. He must be 60. What kind of fashion you rocking? What is the hat piece? It's the, um, ooh, stone scale. Hold on, hold on. Nope, nope, don't do it. Don't do it, don't do it. Where did he go? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Where is he going? Does he know where he's going? Is this an angry turtle? It's not, it's not an angry turtle. Uh, I'm not doing anything with fashion, to be honest with you. I'm just like, whatever crap I can put on my character to survive and deal damage is what I'm wearing right now. I'll worry about fashion later <clears throat> when I have the luxury to think about that. <laughs> There's a horde camp west of the ruins of Eldoroth. Valormok? Shit. Where's he going? <laughs> Crap. Can I get out of here? No, I can't. I just want... Let's see if I can get up. Get on up out of here so I can at least unlock portions of the map. <clears throat> About the Garrett, you see Rogue class relies on burst damage and from its entire kit, there's only one combat finishing move that gives damage increased through CP. Da oh, geez, it's that guy. <clears throat> that is dot effect. Uh, yeah. So you're saying because it's the only one, it should, it should give you two points inst <laughs> instead of one? I don't understand. These guys are everywhere. So to have somewhat worth it using it to fight effectively, you need those two points for low damage opener skill. Blood point, blood fist, am I being chased? I am. I am in danger. Go away. <laughs> Holy shit. This screen's shaking. Uh, there's so many elites. Lake, lake, whatever. Ah, my eye, frick, I'm itching. Okay, I just want to get some kind of flight point before I do anything else. And if that's Volmok or whatever the F, then I'm going to go there. <clears throat> Same as you get two points for cheap shot, since it's a no damage skill. But Garrote is a very high damage skill, <laughs> so it doesn't make a lot of sense to me. In fact, it's probably the highest DPS you can have. It's the highest DPS opener, right? I mean, ambush, like, how do they compare? How do you compare them? Garrote's more damage over time, right? Like, I mean, obviously more damage over time, but you can only ambush once, whereas the Garrote keeps going, and it, I believe it's more damage, right? I'm going to have to do a comparison now. <laughs> Frick. When I'm safely in some sort of camp with a flight point. Nope. Damn it. Mistake. Ah, oh, mistakes were made. I should 
should be able to get away from these. I'm not too worried. I'm not too worried. Just head dead ass west here. And then maybe a little bit north. Can't really bear in mind that the zone you're walking in is so empty. Uh, I don't know. It didn't feel that empty on the beach. Right here, it feels a little empty. <clears throat> Haldar. So... Okay. Not that. So I was almost there. Aha! Friendlies. And there's the flight point. Finally. And here's the quest. This is the only reason I was even here. <laughs> and there it is. Blood Elf Reclaimers and Blood Elf Surveyors. What? Go with honor. Oh, may as well. Kill some Blood Elves. Let me see where this goes, actually. Show me. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, straight to Ogremar. Seven silver. Nice. Nice. What are the quests you got here? Greetings. Stealing knowledge, yeah? The tablets. I knew that was a quest. Go forth to victory. Ah. Rip. <clears throat> I feel obligated to keep all these. Sorry. Making sure the family communication is good. <laughs> great. Great, great, great. <clears throat> Ambush is great with remorseless attacks. Talent that gives it a bonus 40% chance to crit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you're going to do Ambush, you max out every chance to crit for it. If you compare it with total damage, you're right. However, for rogue, time is much more valuable in combat. I know, I know what you're saying. Uh, but it is the highest, you as far as I can remember, it's the highest DPS possible on an opener. So that's why they don't give you two, two points on it. I don't know that, I think if it did give two points as well, it would probably binge into OP yeah, o overpowered territory so I don't know I want to cook these thick hide keep stagnant keep fire from snapper keep bolt of mage we keep sell that would not sell I don't think this I can't I have no idea I suspect this is worthless, but I'm going to hold on to it just in case. This I know is worthless. Have not had any luck selling these anywhere. Uh, we have an overabundance of food at the moment, so we'll get rid of these. And, and what else? All right, let's try to cook.
We do not have a recipe for the new fish that we got. I don't know where it came from. Shoot. <coughs> I wouldn't mind a single CP if the skills were scaling up with rogue AP, but they are not. Well, yeah, but they also don't scale down, so, like, okay, let's... You're gonna make let's me do see. math, aren't you? Oh. So, let's see here. 444 over 18 seconds. Increased. It is increased. It does scale. It increases with your attack power. What do you mean it's not? It is. It says so right there. <laughs> uh, compare that to ambush. 250% weapon damage, plus 185. This is just so much better. <laughs> it's like massively better. Like you have to crit for the ambush to even come close. You have to crit for the, like, first of all, you're stuck on daggers, which is lower damage range anyways. Plus 185, so let's, like, even a good dagger, like the slowest, best dagger at like 50 is going to be like, what, 80, if I'm lucky. So it's a 260, or 80 times 250% is what, 80, 160, 80, 90, 200, two, the 385. So 385 as an opener versus 444 plus AP, increased by AP. I'm not sure how AP works exactly. Let's look at that real quick. <clears throat> Increases damage by 31.8. Melee attack power, 445. Is it, in, when it says it's increased by that, I'm not sure what it means. But this is so much more damage. <laughs> Rupture does not? Yeah, but that's rupture. Like, you don't have to rupture. You can eviscerate. Like, if, if that's, if all you care about is all that scaling, I don't know. I think, no I think Garrod is just fine where it's at. Like, I think having an additional point on it would maybe, maybe make it way OP. That would be my concern anyways. Uh, okay. So we're going to go do this? I guess so. <clears throat> Beth Amara. Oh, wait. This is not the same. We'd have to get rid of something. And Najara. Huh. Okay. Hold on. Hold on here. This. That's the one. We can get that whenever we go there, so we don't need it. Ah, there we are. <clears throat> Eviscerate a static. Increased by attack power. Wait. Why are you making stuff up? <laughs> Increased by your attack power. They're all, they all increase by attack power. What are you talking about? I mean, it says it on there. Are you saying they're lying? That it's not true? I'm confused. I'm not sure what you're getting at. <sighs> uh. Humber's sword. What? Oh, it's a quest. All right. <clears throat> 
What the frick am I doing here? Uh, I need to go to the northern Pernitz, this one, and kill Blood Elves. For two different groups. <clears throat> Let's see here. Oh. Okay, this, this was the quest from that guy. Northern Peninsula. All right, let's just go in that direction and see what happens. <clears throat> Maybe there's a back way. Barman Shanker is level 50 rare dagger. Ambush is a normalized ability. Normalized. Unless Turtle Bow actually changed and fixed it. I don't know. Right now on the text it says that they're... Uh, ambush doesn't, but the others say that they're... Oh, shit. Oh, no. It says that... Ah! Look! Look, 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 look. No, it's, I have to be stealthed. Hold on. Okay. Let's just look at it. It says... For ambush, it's 250% weapon damage plus 185. So that is a normalized ability. Everything else says that it is increased by attack power. So ambush is normalized. And Garrot, eviscerate, rupture, sin strike is normalized. Repost is normalized. There you go. So it's only the dots that give you AP, attack power benefits. Everything else is normalized. <clears throat> so really, this is Garrot's already OP AF. <laughs> so I would, why do you want it to give you two points as well? You don't even need it. Like, look at the... I understand that, like, you know, most of the time, if you're soloing, you're not going to get the maximum out of it, but that's just a choice you make. If. Hello? What's this? Uh -huh. The dark times will pass. Will they? The reckoning. What the shit? <laughs> okay. How are you? Okay. That's Have just to get one. back down. What the fuck is this? Where am I? What is this shit? <clears throat> hmm, sounds like it's now actually worth leveling a rogue on Turtle Wild then. Yeah, man, get on here. What are you doing? <laughs> has has my <laughs> How long have I been playing? Has my 9 days and 54 minutes of live streaming this game not proven that it's worth it? <laughs> like uh, the DPS listed on the weapon is more important than the top end damage. A fast weapon with high DPS will hit harder than a slow weapon with higher damage on normalized abilities. No, I thought it was the opposite. I've, I've always, since day one, working on World of Warcraft, the understanding was that you wanted a slow weapon with the highest damage range on your main hand because the sinister strike uses that and therefore because you're always using the sinister strike that's the best way to increase damage same for daggers and backstab and ambush and everything you want the slowest highest damage whereas on the offhand you want this the fastest highest dps that is 
Not friendly. What the fuck? Where am I and why am I here? Am I supposed to be here? Am I not supposed to be here? I don't understand. What's it teleported me up here, so. <clears throat> I don't like the look of that. Let's stealth in. It's level 50, so I should be able to escape in theory. This and classic also scaled with AP? I don't know. Uh, they might have changed it in patch 1.8, but in Turtle Wow, it, it, it doesn't. Or it does? Wait, oh, Mark Mage Asylum. He's friendly. Hi. Okay, he's not friendly. Or rather, he doesn't speak. Wait. Do that yet. Should probably not have unstealthed then. Okay, they seem okay. They have nothing to say to me, so that was useless. Why am I here? What is this? Looks like a quest happens here. Alright, I am the new Archmage of this tower. This is my tower. Just kidding, I don't cast spells. Spells are for pussies. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> That's not an insult. Pussies are very powerful. They can push up entire humans. So. When someone calls you a pussy, it's actually a compliment. And you should take it that way. All right. I don't know what the hell I was supposed to do there. There doesn't seem to be anything going on for me. This character maybe does something, but not for me. So we're going to... Look around, at least. Could I? Would I live? I think I would. I'm going to try. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, no problem. These are furball, yeah? Timber Maw Hold. Are they aggro? They're like orange, which is quite unusual. I think... Oh, that, yeah, I just, I got some faction with them recently. I don't know if that makes them not hate me. He did not aggro. All right, I guess I'm okay with them. <clears throat> Let us continue on our merry way to murder high elves, or sorry, blood elves. Wow, none of these are mad at me. Okay, perfect, great, love it. Do they have a vendor here? No, it doesn't look like it. <clears throat> yeah, TOS started from patch 1.12. Most of the instant attack abilities are normalized. <clears throat> well, if you look at Eviscerate, increased by attack power. Eh? When you say normalized, you mean it, it, it accounts for AP. AP was normalized before TBC patch. Uh, okay. Timber Maw Hold. Where are the elves? Okay, don't fall down there. Shattered Strand. Oh man, this place is huge. By normalized, I mean weapon damage normalization. I see. <clears throat> I was thinking the opposite, meaning that it was not, that it had its own damage ranges, which it does, so. So it's not normalized by the weapon. Timber Maw, no problem. Where are them blood elves at? Needs me some blood elves to eat. Ursalon. Ursa means bear. <clears throat> oh. 
Sorry, I'll be right back. Food arrived. I think I promised never to eat on stream. <laughs> no one wants to hear mouth noises. IMO. Uh, I'd love to have a Garrett talent and subtlety tree to increase its duration and give each tick a chance to crit. <laughs> each ch Christians, yeah. Who wouldn't? That would be great. I don't know. There's a... Actually, you know who you should follow? If you don't already, Vrograg. Because he's on the uh, council for the for rogues. The community council. So, definitely something you could bring to him. Okay, what am I going to do here? Am I going to camp out and then start up again later? I'm gonna eat. I don't want to eat on stream, so I'm gonna I'm gonna camp out, and then uh, I do plan to stream again today. We'll see if I can. I don't want to promise if I can't. Uh, I will probably stream later, but I, uh, I'm not 100 percent on that yet. Stuff your mouth as much as you can. <laughs> no, I don't think so. All right, guys. Thank you for stopping in. I'll I'll talk to you guys later.